meditation is more fundamental than waking, dreaming or sleeping. For those of my devotees who would yet understand themselves most fundamentally, and for those of my devotees who, because they understand themselves most fundamentally, will not settle for less than freedom and happiness, and for those of my devotees who would enjoy the ultimate and inherently perfect realisation of the inherently perfect, intrinsically egoless and self-evidently divine self-nature, self-conditioned, source-conditioned and self-state, and for those of my devotees who have recovered the unique and comprehensively effective ability to more and more satisfy the impulse toward most perfectly ego-transcending, transcendental, inherently spiritual and self-evidently divine, real God realization, meditation, or as the case may be, perfect contemplation, has become as necessary as food and rest, and more fundamental than the waking state itself, or the dreaming state, or the state of deep sleep. Therefore, as you listen to me, and when you hear me, and also when you see me, do not be pre preoccupied with the problem of the ego I, or the problems of the self-contracted body-mind complex. Do not consent to be deluded and held captive by the body-mind self and its functions, its presumed needs, its states, its relations, its reactions, its sufferings, its thoughts and its illusions. Do not seek happiness by means of identification with the conditional self and its world, as if the body-mind self and its relations are in and or as themselves everlasting and identical to happiness itself. Be truly and by truth aroused from your waking state and indeed from every psychophysical or conditional state. Indeed, be thus aroused daily and then ultimately and inherently most perfectly. Let your inherent identity as the by me avatarically self-revealed, free, transcendental, inherently spiritual, intrinsically egoless and self-evidently divine self-nature, self-condition, source condition and self-state of all and all be soon and by means of my avatarically self-transmitted divine transcendental spiritual grace, directly aroused by means of true and deepest meditation and in due course perfect contemplation on, in and as me, the only one who is.